So if Afghanistan is a priority, and we're not necessarily having the gap that you mentioned, is the MOD going to be in a position of having to ask the Treasury for more funds? No. Okay. Except, of course, don't forget Afghanistan is funded out of the, um, the reserve for urgent operational requirements. That's over and above the core MOD budget. Okay, so th there would be an allowance there. That, that, that's planned for estimates are made at the beginning of each year. Okay. Uh, so that money is not out of the core budget. And how much might we expect could be funneled out of that? Well, we will do what's necessary to, to make sure we can sustain the effort in Afghanistan. Um, we're confident we'll do that. How would you respond to, uh, go headlines, how would you respond to the claim that Tories are weak on defence? We can do, well, <laughs> that's, a, that's a novel one, I must admit. Um, well, no, I, I, no, I'm not saying that we, as I've said earlier, that we wouldn't like to avoid him making some of these difficult decisions. For example, taking Harry out of service earlier, taking the Nimrod MRA4 out of service. Um, but uh, one thing we cannot be weak on is addressing the deficit. And we think the risks we're taking in defence, there are some risks, are calculated ones that we understand, which we think it's prudent to take, to address the much bigger risk of national bankruptcy.